Now let's get down to business to defeat the Huns and get some steamed hams for the Twitch chat. Uh, we can't build anything. I haven't played in a while, but I feel my knowledge is still there in what we're doing. We're doing a Necromancer run. I will not give up on you, Necromancer. I love your skeletons. You just make it a little bit hard. Um, maybe I should get less cards. Like, maybe, maybe we don't mess with the swamp because we want to have a lot of life. We want a lot. We want a lot of regen, so I don't really want a swamp. Who wants to see my breakfast? It's insane. Clicking it. It's loading. That looks like it'll kill a man. <laughs> the YouTube audience will never know what it was, but it looks like it would kill a man. I will say that. And let's venture out to the boss. And let's see how we do. We haven't played Loop Hero in a while. I decided to start with Loop Hero because Loop Hero is usually a game that doesn't do good on Twitch. So I was like, let's start with it, you know? Let's start with it so we can get that slowness out of the way. It doesn't do good in terms of chat engagement because of how this game is. The way this game's designed, it doesn't really yield the best results for an active twitch chat i feel unless you're a ginormous streamer which i am not believe it or not i am not a giant streamer i am a tiny little baby streamer still but i saw a nice youtube comment today before i started streaming someone commented on an isaac video saying they liked the content and they just discovered it and it's like yeah well, yeah you better like that content we're going to double the wheat fields because I make choices in my life. I'm giant in your heart. Game nerd, I can't wait for you to be my number one mod. Uh, skeleton level will get higher, but I like having regen already. Magic shield goes down, so we get nothing really good here. We get some summon quality up with that ring. Sure. I'm still not sure what type of run I want to build with the Necromancer. I definitely want some regen. I feel like regen and maybe high skeleton level would be good. Ooh, that's high magic shield already. Hey, cat loaf. What? 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 Oh, what now, Catloaf? Jesus. What now? Always come in yelling at me because I suck at games. Max skeletons. I think I'm going to get rid of defense because I don't really care about defense. We'll throw the storm temple right on the camp because that's where the boss spawns. And I feel that will be good against the boss. Summon quality goes up. Skeleton level goes up. We lose some regen, but we already have some extra regen. Regen's at 1.2. We can lower it to 0.6. We can lower it to 0.6. Sure, why not? A blood grove, but not a regular grove. We got a nice little treasure chest here. Ooh. Defense 2, regen 1.2. Skeleton quality goes down to 22%. We do get some regen. Summon quality goes up, but shield goes down by 13, but we get two defense as well. Maybe I want defense. Maybe I want high defense with this thing, and we never knew it. Ooh, treasury early on is nice. The Boston Celtics start their NBA playoff 2023 journey tomorrow as of making this... And let me tell you, I am excited to see the Celtics hopefully dominate the Eastern Conference. I will say um, my biggest concern is probably Giannis Anadokounmpo. I love you, bird. Love you too. Townie. Thank you for the eight months. I greatly appreciate it. I hope you're doing good. I hope work is good. Congratulations on the eight months, even though two days ago it was your seven months. Congrats, congrats. We talk about higher rarities have worse stat scaling because that really puzzles me. 
Yeah, this game is weird. I don't 100% understand the stat scaling. I know different colors represent different types of stats they'll have. And I know if they have multiple stats, then, uh... With multiple stats, you know, they're not going to be... You can't have 17 stats that are all super high, but... It's still a little puzzling, you know? Work is work. You caught it like three days in a row. You were so over it. Time to quit. Why do work like that when you can stay at home? Home! Maybe fighting these skeletons was not a good idea for these, uh, these scarecrows. They are f***ing me up. Regen per second goes down. Summon quality goes up, though. My regen per second would be one... would be 0.6. Sure. But my summon quality is 92. What's up, Lodima? No work equals no home. This is true. I'm a little concerned when uh, the Alberta move happens. Uh, I won't be able to stream for a while. So it's like, all right, well, let's see if I can still pay. Let's see if I can pay rent. I think everything will be fine, though. I won't be able to stream for a couple weeks. Uh, regen stays the same. Summon quality goes down. Defense goes up. Summon quality goes down by 1%. So I'll, I'll sacrifice the 1% summon quality. Ooh, we could get a third skeleton, but we lose skeleton level by a little bit. We get some evasion and some more defense. Uh, sure. My defense is six. No burgle streams? Nah, I won't be able to stream. It'll all depend on how the internet is, how, where, where my, when my PC shows up and all that. Yeah, sorry, Burgle won't be around. Burgle might be preoccupied. To binge my YouTube videos. That's the good news. I'll have uh, a Let's Play channel. We'll keep everything going. And all that. The Let's Play channel is getting close to YouTube Partner. At this rate, it should get YouTube Partner eventually. It just needs to get more subscribers. My regular channel is still giving me some money here and there, so that's nice. I just need to get more subs on the Let's Play channel, aka the channel that if you're watching this on YouTube, you're watching it on. But it's like almost at 4,000 watch hours because I just upload like everything from the stream without even worrying about view numbers. And it's just... Ooh, we get 15 magic shield and better quality summons. Sure. Time to rent a billboard. Sub the Sleeping Bear Let's Play on YouTube. Jesus Christ. I got so many good skeletons and they all suck. Give me the goddamn shield. Give me this damn... I'm gonna take... I might just take this damn regen, to be honest. I might sacrifice... 24% summon quality... For that regen. Give me an extra max... I got four skeletons! We're insane. Four skeletons coming up. I'm a little concerned because we have the, uh... Okay, I think I want as many skeletons as possible. Because... And I'll get more shield. Every summoned skeleton gets me a shield. Keep taking your antiquary and then forgetting them to open things. That's a common mistake. Common mistake. We all do it. Even I do that still. I get, I take an antiquarian with me and I'm like, all right, let's get a bunch of money. 
And then it's like, hey, all right, Crusader, open this chest up. Wait a minute. I have an antiquarian for that. Oh, no. There, well, the Crusader now took all my money. Thanks, Renald. Uh... Regen stays the same. Summon quality goes up. Lose defense, gain evasion. Sure. Evasion's up to 16%. Eh, freaking Renald being a kleptomaniac son of a bitch. I think this is going to be the run. This is going to be the run where I finally get past Chapter 2. I have something that cannot be touched and it cannot be stopped. It can't be moved and it can't be rocked. And it's confidence. We got high level skeletons coming for days. We got mountains giving me more HP for days. Pop off Dr. Seuss. Yeah. I feel like Dr. Seuss in, in 2023 would be a very, very well respected rapper. But then people will find out he's racist and everyone will be like, oh my goodness, cancel Dr. Seuss. It's just like, yeah, 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 fuck this guy. <laughs> a white guy from how, when the hell was Dr. Seuss? Okay, wait a minute. One, Dr. Seuss. Dr. Seuss was born in 1904 and died in 1991. So I'm going to say it. I feel the potential of a not-so-great human is there. Good books, yes, but a not-so-good human. Didn't he do some messed up stuff with his wife? Yeah, he married her. Ho 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 Don't get married. What are... Why is Dr. Seuss so popular? Who the fuck is Google and why is Dr. Seuss so popular? The dude made the cat in the hat. And green eggs and ham. I do not like green eggs and ham. I do not like them, Sam I am. I do not like them on a boat. I will not like them with... Blah, blah, blah. What I've heard, he has later learned... He later learned and regretted it. So his early work, he had some... Not so good stuff, but later in his life, he was educated on the matter, maybe, and he le he uh, lived to regret those mistakes. I think his wife had cancer and he cheated on her. It's so easy to not cheat. Just be like, hey. My love is dead for you. Goodbye. They'd be like, all right, goodbye. Goodbye. See you later. Well, I'm to pick up the pieces in my life. Regen, bring it down to 0.6. Summon quality up by two. Evasion up by one extra percent. Uh, magic shield. Ooh, lose some summon quality. Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to do that. But we want this high magic shield. We'll lose a skeleton, but we'll gain some attack speed. So we're down to two skeletons again. Which is actually not good. I need more skeletons. I need more skeletons! Tell me why ain't nothing but a heartache. Tell me why ain't nothing but a fruit cake. Is this this? The statistics on men leaving their wives after finding out they have a chronic illness is awful. It is so high that nurses will warn women when they are in the hospital about it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say I'm not surprised because people are pieces of shit and don't want to deal with that in their life. It's horrible, and I wouldn't do it. But it's like when you, if you're if you're getting married to someone, marriage. Marriage is the ultimate commitment. Like, if you're slapping a ring on it, you're in that shit for life. And 
Maybe you fall out of love, you don't like what they've become, all that stuff. Okay, that's fine. A chronic illness? You can't really control that happening. Come on, don't be a piece of shit. Like, divorces happen all the time. We can respect that. We can understand that. But, like, after that happens, it's like, okay, dude. Right after she gets cancer, you decide that you hate her mom or something like that. Or you hate the way she sings in the shower. Okay, that's very coincidental, I'd feel. This is not good because they... They kill my skeletons. I should actually keep my max skeletons pretty high. I should get them an edible. <laughs> uh, so funny. Uh, I make myself... I crack myself up. Man! This fucking sucks. I'm hungry, but I just brushed my teeth, so I can't eat food for about 12 years. It's like I had that minty fresh toothpaste. What percentage of men leave wives when they're sick? Image result for what the statistics for men leaving with chronic illnesses among study participants, the divorce rate was 21% for seriously ill women and 3% for seriously ill men. The control group divorced at a rate of 12% suggested that if disease makes husbands more likely to spit, it makes wives more likely to stay. So you're telling me, you're telling me women are better than men? I can see that. I mean, I... I can see it. Surprise! I'm just waiting for the United States to have its first woman president to fix everything that all these shitty men have done. Because there's no way a woman could fuck up that badly, right? There's no way! There's no way! I'm gonna have such a high shield by the end of this. Because we're not even halfway towards the goddamn boss spawn. And then there's A1. This fucking guy. A sleepy yuck. And I can yuck and do it again, sleeping bear. I can yuck and do it again. We lose attack speed, gain some evasion. Our evasion is quite high. But we lose half our summon quality. Sure. Get 34 evasion. Maybe I'll be dodging and weaving. Oh, a bandy camp. Gross. I believe there should be an age gap on politicians because what the fuck is 87 year old Mitch McConnell gonna do for the future? This dude's gonna be dead in like five months anyways. Why like why are all these old white men caring about the future when they're gonna when they're not even gonna be part of the future? Like they're gonna die soon. Like Joe Biden? I don't know politics too well, so I don't know what he's doing or how people perceive him, but the dude's almost like 90, isn't he? Like, does he really have the best interest for the future of Americans when he's going to be dead for most of the future? <laughs> Dude is so old. I don't know. Maybe that's me talking out my ass. I swear, becoming like a senator or like a politician, I swear your IQ goes down by like a thousand. What, listen to some of these people talk. It's like, God, you're an idiot. How the fuck are you elected? Who's voting for these people? Like when the the, the, the TikTok uh, 
the TikTok CEO was um, on trial for TikTok stuff. I, I'm not. Uh, I'm not fully. I, they, they were just asking a bunch of questions to this guy. I kept calling him Chinese man, even though he's from Singapore. And they couldn't understand anything he was saying, even though he was saying the most basic shit. It's like, oh, this poor dude. Like, listen, I don't like TikTok. I don't care about TikTok, but like, oh my God. He had to talk to old white people. Oh, this is not going good. talk to an old white person we horrible I don't even know what skeleton level does to be honest my skeleton level is 5.3 i don't even know what the fuck that does My magic shield, though, it's very high. Evasion goes down by 2%. We lose the regen. That's the only regen we have. We gain skeleton level by, like, 2. But I don't know skeleton level, so I don't care. Evasion goes up. We get attack speed, but we lose skeleton level. And we lose our regen. But we gain... I'm gonna take the attack speed. Am I gonna try out the new Vampire Survivors DLC? I didn't try out the first one. I mean, how different could the DLC make the game? It's fucking vampire survivors, you know? Like, what, what am I doing? Good morning, Gamer Pro. What's up, Rhinos? Happy Friday. much damage they do well, i guess that can make sense just new stuff ah. ah let me finish my let me get all my achievements in gunsuit guardians can i get some like can i get some like things to destroy all these goblin camps they're everywhere they're gonna kill me at this rate some oblivions This is going to be rough. When an allied skeleton kills an enemy, it fully heals itself and gets a 10% damage and HP buff for the rest of the battle. Each loop, three higher quality skeletons join the hero side. They persist between battles. Plus one to a maximum number of skeletons. I'll tell you that. Thank you very much. Damage and health summon quality is the chance they'll be special. Okay. Well, every skeleton I summon gets me one extra shield, so. You're gaining bulk? I'm not. <laughs> I don't need enough food. Forget those gains. Help me, skeletons! Oh shit, I don't even have a ring on. What the fuck just happened to that ring? Apparently I got rid of a ring. I don't even realize it. Guess I'll just take an extra skeleton for now. Only issue is you have a big butt. Eh, they cannot lie. I lost my regen because I lost that ring. All right, take defense and summon quality. I don't need five skeletons. All 
I'm trying to get some oblivion before I put anything else on. Oh, man, I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose now. I, what the hell? Okay, regen per second. Thank you. I'll take that. Maybe I won't lose now. This is regen. But we do have to fight two goblins. I might lose. Can I please get an oblivion? I need to destroy these goblin camps. They're everywhere, man. All right, well, fuck it. Let's just throw down a bunch of stuff and just accept the defeat. <clears throat> I like sleepy yuck and I cannot lie. Those other, other yucks can't deny. When a yuck walks in with an itty bitty face, you wound it in her face to get sprung. On a double like that, you notice that yuck was stuck. I don't even have any summon quality. I'll take three skeletons. Gets a little bit of summon quality back. What up, shiny? Am I enjoying the loopy loop? Always enjoy the loopy loop. How are you doing? I would like to gain an oblivion to, you know, help me, but... That's fine, I guess. We don't need Oblivion. It'll just be nice to get rid of these goddamn two bandit camps and goblin camps that are going to eventually kill me, probably. How are you doing? skeletons ah it's a battlefield you know love is a battlefield loving the loop on the youtube as well as the new dome keeper the new dome keeper is gonna get replaced again by gunsuit guardians for a little bit my skeletons are not doing any damage to these skeletons But the new Dome Keeper is quite fun. I will say that. I am enjoying it. The little I've gotten to play. I'll drop some attack speed and some evasion. Get some summon quality up, I guess. You're up to 160 in muscle now. Nice. Nice. Get them gains. Oh, I should have put it down here. Ah, whatever. Wall world? Nah, yeah, wall world. Not dome keep. Not actual dome keeper. Sixteen percent evasion. Bring it up to thirty-seven. And still have a pretty good regen of 1.8. Lose 9 evasion, gain 1% summon quality. Regen stays the same. Why would I want that? Did legs 3 days so far? You did leg day 3 days in a row? What in the fuck? Where are my skeletons? Come on, skeletons! God damn. 
attack speed is the rate at which you produce skellies. I swear, it got worse. Well, we might be in trouble. We might be in trouble with all these enemies we have to fight. Look at all these enemies. We're probably screwed right over here. Unless we get a goddamn... Here. I say we're screwed. Let me put down more enemies. Oh. What up, Elder Totoro? Eh, not for long, probably. This run ain't looking too hot. retreat i know i'm not gonna win so let's retreat and let's build a supply depot unlocks the supply feature from now on you will start finding useful supply items for the people in the camp unlocks the ability to craft supply items if you have the necessary buildings unlock the ruins card yeah let's do that good news we've come up with a list of things we need i can't say they're all absolutely necessary but they would make our lives a bit better we can't keep eating dirt while sitting on dirt and then go to sleep on the same, you know, dirt. I'm exaggerating, of course. Just want you to get the idea. If you stumble upon a good piece of furniture or a tool or anything else of use, remember where you found it and accompany a horse carriage there will... And accompany a horse carriage there. We'll make sure you find it. We'll make sure your findings go to the people who need it the most. Now the game begins. You get the ruins. Gives a random basic resource shard when passing through it. Spawns a scorch worm every two days. Well, let's see what the ruins does. I'm gonna not take the cemetery this time. And I'm not gonna take... Uh, Blood Grove either. Maybe spider cocoons. Maybe the spiders won't. No, spiders suck. All right, we'll, uh, we'll just rock it like this. We'll get ruins in, see how that is. We'll keep everything else. I'm going to keep going Necromancer. I want to win with the Necromancer. Do I need to have more cards here? You can't stop me. Oh, I guess you can stop me. Uh, it's fine. Blood Grove. Might as well. Sad it didn't get extra content after release this game. Yeah, it's a good one. Very, very nice. Very, very fun. Let the game begin. We have finally got the supply depot unlocked. And let's see how we can do with the Necromancer now. Start building a mountain as usual. We'll build the mountain. The book. Skeleton level 0.86. Oh, we get Oblivion this early on. Oh, I all tabbed out by accident. I put the soundtrack in a few of my videos on YouTube because it's such a good soundtrack and sometimes the soundtrack just goes well with whatever I'm talking about. I wish, I wish it was a better game to stream, but it's a good game for YouTube, that's for sure. Every roguelite's a good game for YouTube compared to streaming it. Rocks. What's this? Skeleton level 0.95? Sure.
Meadow, sure. We have a ring. Summon quality, sure. Treasury, sure. Why is it not good for streaming? I mean, at a stream at my size, it just doesn't really perform well compared to some other games. That's just the sad truth. Uh, for me, some games just don't really do good. And in my history of streaming this game, it's just... It doesn't really get chat talking a lot. It doesn't really bring in, like, new viewers or anything like that. But it's still a lot of fun, so I'm still going to stream it every once in a while. Summon quality and skeleton level? Sure. Every run starts off really good, and then it just starts getting so bad. I'll throw down another ruins. Feels like backseating. Yeah, I guess that could also do things. People that have played the game may might feel like they're backseating in some areas. Oh, I should have put it right there. Eh, whatever. Eh, whatever. I need some health regen. I appreciate everyone that watches, though. I got a lot of games to play today, so we're going to be rapid firing around the games today. Get ready. Get rid of that bandit camp. I've never seen these before, and well, I won't see much of them now because they're dead. Skeleton level goes up. We get some evasion and shield. So grim and pixely and they don't want they want flashy or cozy as someone who uh, streams overwatch occasionally and overwatch does very well i'm pretty sure i don't really look at the numbers but i've been told overwatch does good uh yeah overwatch is very flashy i wouldn't say overwatch is cozy but it's flashy Yeah, the ruin enemies, those damn worms. Well, hopefully they put up a better fight next time. I'm just gonna throw a meadow over here. We'll throw some we'll throw something else over there later. Uh ring 8% speed. Sure. They're exactly the same. Summon quality will go down by a uh, sure. Why not? Give me that attack speed. Let me summon them faster. Hey, there's the hey, there's the ruin enemy. The uh, the worm takes a uh, dart in battles on adjacent tiles. Ranged combat minus thirty percent damage in second row. Retreat forty percent chance to flee instead of being killed. Oh, it escaped. That's kind of cool. They run away. What's up, Alu? How are you? Hey, Alu. Level goes down. Not really. We lose quality for sure, so we don't get any good skeletons. We gain attack speed and regen. I'll take no quality for now, just so I can have a skeletons come faster. Count down to the weekends. Yeah. Life is stressful. Where is my mind by the pixies? Come on, skeletons, kill them! Ah, it escaped again. Amulet. Attack speed and an extra skeleton? Sure. Where is my mind? 
Where is my mind? Spawned the bandit camp. I saw that coming. We have 32% attack speed right now. 32% attack speed. We have the power within. So we're spawning skeletons when they die. And we can have three skeletons total. We still don't have our first point. Give me an upgrade point. Another treasury spawned. Uh, we'll throw it right here. Sure. We'll throw love is a battlefield right over here. Trying to get as much health as I can from these mountains. What's this? Ah, it's a shield. Ah! Regen goes up. Skeleton level goes up. We lose attack speed. I will sacrifice a little bit of attack speed. Our attack speed's still solid at 24. Oh my god. Well, this could be the end. One escaped. One died. Two died. All right, that's convenient. Ooh, the bandit camp. Ooh, I hate the bandit. What the hell is this thing doing? Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> what are you doing over here, Scorchworm? Get out of here. What are, what are you doing? Move into the country. Gonna eat me a lot of peaches. Welcome to the archers. <laughs> they're, they're just chilling out in the corner. Like, what the hell are they doing? Get out of here. What the fuck? What in the world? Uh, Blood Grove. At least it's only one bandit. This time around. That's a lot of stuff on the ring. Attack speed stays the same. We lose a little bit of regen. We gain evasion and we gain summon quality. We get rid of the right ring. Sure. Sure. Summon quality is up to 22. What Timothy Chalamet did? What did Timothy Chalamet... Are you telling me somebody fucked a peach? Is this like that one time somebody fucked a McChicken? Remember when McChicken was trending on Twitter and everyone was like, don't click that one. And then some people were like, ah, I'm going to click it anyways. How bad could it be? And it was a dude, you know, just going ham on a chicken. You're struggling to put a valid phone number. What's the correct format for European mobile numbers? Uh, would it be one area code phone number? Wait a minute. Let me see. One's for the U.S. European Area Code International. I don't know. One, I think, is North America. I think Canada has one as well. I think it depends on what country you're from. Hey, who in here from Europe has bought Sleeping Bear merch before? I've bought merch for a lot of Europeans, but I usually just... My phone number? My business phone number? Yeah, I'm fancy. I got a business phone. What of it? Nothing works. Tantrum! Tantrum, ding dong! Tantrum, where are you? I guess we'll get strong skeletons in a day. So suck on someone fucking a McChicken? Eh, don't worry about that one. That was years ago. What up, Paul? Uh.
three stakes. Sup, buds? I was late to the stream today because I was at the gym this morning. I don't get a lot of games at the gym. I more so go to the gym to keep a well-toned body. Don't use auto-completes for it. You have to put it in manually. Thanks for wanting to buy a shirt. Hopefully the alert plays because there is an alert for people that buy shirts. I'll sacrifice the regen for that. I was wearing a merch shirt yesterday, actually. It's one of my favorite shirts, actually. It's the white shirt that has just, like, the bear rolling around on it. It's one of my favorites. It didn't get your username? Well, let's see if... Let's see if the tantrum alerts even still work. I, ha I have tantrum alerts on Nave. I don't even remember what it is. It's probably a loud darkest dungeon alert, knowing me. Knowing me, it's a loud darkest dungeon alert, and it'll be very annoying. Popped up. It did? Well, didn't even hear it. <laughs> guess it doesn't have an alert. I guess I didn't hear it. Well, thank you for buying a shirt. I greatly appreciate it. It's actually funny. They just got rid of the tumblers on Tantrum. They just got rid of the tumblers. They said they might bring it back in the future, but they uh, got rid of those. Everything in the world is, uh, a video game. Anything you ever look up on the internet will be a video game. Let's get rid of that one. Burr, oh. Gabby, oh! Gabby, oh! What up, Gabby? Oh, I'm about to die, probably. Maybe. Dude, how the fuck did all of them escape? Hey, Adernus. Yeah, I've been rocking the Necromancer for the last uh, handful of runs trying to figure them out. It's a work in progress, but we're going, you know, we're going. How are you, Gabby? I was late to the stream today. Don't tell my manager. I'm my manager. should be stoned way ahead of you kid You're very tired of you doing all right today i'm a little tired too my mind is racing a mile a minute but we still stay strong One forty-three. Oh, do I want to lose half my attack speed and gain twelve evasion, but lose a skeleton for thirty-two extra shield? Not yet. Not yet. I'm liking what we're doing. I'm liking what we're doing right now. I'm liking what we're. I'm liking what's going on. Gain some regen. Yeah, but we lose four attack speed and fifteen evasion and a skeleton. I don't want to lose a skeleton. I don't want to lose a skeleton. Every time I have a lot of skeletons, the runs seem to go a lot better whenever there's more of them. Who would have thought? The more skeletons, the better. Goodbye, bandit camp, even though I need to get rid of this goblin camp as well. Oh, goodness gracious. Take it from a loop hero pro. Honestly, I have a flight to Alberta in a couple weeks. It's like a four hour flight. I think my flight, I'm just gonna play loop hero on the switch and read a book. That's all I'm gonna do. Because I have, like, every single... Ro the roguelite video for the Switch games that I made, I had to spend $300 on roguelites. Because I had to make sure they all ran on the Switch. 
So I have all these amazing games on my Switch now that are all downloaded, ready to go. And Loop Hero was one of them. It's funny because I've always wanted to play Loop Hero and I know a handful of people in chat have always wanted to watch me play Loop Hero. And then I played it for a video without streaming it the first time and I was like, holy shit, dude, this game is incredible. Halfway to the boss spawn. Holy moly, this game's incredible. It's so good. Who could hate the loop? Got to get rid of that goblin camp. Don't really want any more ruins because I already got all these freaking snakes I need to fight. Uh, higher attack speed, better evasion, better level. We lose a skeleton. Nah, I don't want to lose one. Summon quality is... Uh, what's my level? 3.53. I... Uh, uh, there's no benefits really of those. There's no benefits with this one, really. There's no benefits. What do we get? 3% better summon quality? I mean, but then we lose 4% attack speed. Go, skeletons, go! Holy shit. They just went nuts. Wait a minute. Lose half our attack speed, but we keep the skeleton. We gain 69 shield, 59 shield. Get a little bit of level and we gain some more evasion. Honestly, I'm going to take the risk and lower the attack speed. But we have a lot more shield now. That one I think could be worth it. I still keep all my skeletons here. We almost have another upgrade as well. We have an upgrade. Each loop, three higher quality skeletons join the hero side. They persist between battles. Each time the hero passes through, resources cap and will heal heal for speech. Uh, I guess we'll do the horde. We'll make, we'll get some stronger skellies. Sure. Get them stronger skellies. The horde is definitely the best sounding one from all of those. Don't really want any more villages. We have, we have enough of those. You shouldn't backseat. It makes you feel better. I clicked horde before I saw you type it. I feel like I made the right choice with you screaming about Horde. <laughs> the right choice has been made today. Tax speed, summon quality. We lose some evasion. Attack speed stays the same. And we lose skeleton level. Dude, these rings. This is a level 6 ring, but it doesn't feel like it's better than a level 3 ring. Is that just how Loop Hero works? It's like, yeah, this ring is technically 4 levels higher, but it's not better than this level 3. That's just the way it is sometimes. A singular strike. Yo, I'm past spooky 95 spin spooky 95 spin spooky 95 spin spooky 95 spin spooky number 5 spin spooky number 5 spin spooky number 5 spin spooky number 5 spin Yo, password Password, thank you for the two months of the tier 1 subbing. I greatly appreciate it. Enjoy the emotes. 
attack speed goes up regen goes up evasion stays the same but we lose summon quality but we gain level i'm gonna replace this one summon quality at 25 but everything else went up Now I just need to actually get through a level. Come on, skeletons. Okay, skeletons. Uh, no, we don't want those. I'm feeling this run. Yeah, yeah. The real question is, with the horde, will we get them if we can make the boss spawn? Game really wants me to have villages, but I don't really want villages. What's my regen at? 1.2? Okay. Ah! Oh my god, a little slime. Oh no, a little slime. Battlefield. Loves a battlefield. Ooh. No. We are young! Heartache, your heartache, do you stand strong? Another treasury is pretty nice. I got two goblin camps here, and they. I need to get a goddamn. Uh, I need to get a goddamn. I did not, cat. I did not. It'd be really nice to, because I've recently discovered a lot of bangers. Snowman knows everything. They're so smart. Oh, big guy spawns. <gasps> oh, we got some big boys. We got some big boys. Oh my god, they, they walk with me. <laughs> oh, I love that. They just walk with me. They're protecting the president right now. We lose some regen. Quality at 28. We lose attack speed. Quality goes up by three. Level stays the same. Evasion stays the same. We gain regen for attack speed. Sure. I'll take that risk. Like, Abba took a chance on me. I'll take a chance on that. I could lower evasion for attack speed now, though. But then I lose a skeleton. I don't want to lose a skeleton. I don't want to lose one. And my, these skeletons, they're basically my best friend. I don't want to lose them. You know what I mean? Uh-oh. A flesh golem is here. God, look at those spawns, dude. Oh, my. Do I want to sacrifice most of my evasion? Well, actually, I have 30% evasion. I could sacrifice 9% of it. Gain 19 shield, gain 20 attack speed, a higher skeleton level, and some defense. But then I lose a skeleton. I don't want to lose a skeleton. Don't want to lose one. What's up, Saturns? Hi, hi, hi. How are you? Hey, how are you?
I feel like I can't afford to lose a max skeleton. Ugh. Hold on to these. I'm gonna hold on to all of these because maybe... The next level up we get will get me like, hey, get one extra max skeleton. And then I can just have four rock in it still. You're tired? How am I? I am good. Doing my best. Doesn't seem much better. Well, this one could be better. This one's better than that one by a little bit. Storm temples. Throw one down. Oh my god, we are gonna have some fun right over here. Oh boy. Oh boy. We are gonna have some fun right over there. Storm temples are your friend that helped you kill the first boss. I'm hoping the storm temple can help me kill the second boss. But I've only gotten to fight the second boss once. I need an oblivion to show up. Oh. Hoping the storm temples go to hell. Shit! Okay. I respect that. I do. I respect it. I see where you're coming from. I'm scared about this area right here. I'm scared about this area and this area. We're gonna rock three skeletons. I don't want to rock three skeletons, but I think I have to. Just for now. Just so we can have the skeletons be a lot stronger. That was the area I was concerned about, and we survived. How are these rings doing? Love is a battlefield. We are young. Oh, we're getting close to that boss spawn. We're getting close to another uh, trinket as well. And I hope I get the max skeleton one. That would be nice. One extra max skeleton with the stats that we have would be beautiful. gotten any oblivions on this run.
Oh, wow. Wait, this, my, this does minus four damage to all vampires? Plus 1% base HP for every food item placed in your camp. This tool is unmatched in a making lots of sparks and loyal companions. All blacksmiths respects hard work and a firm hand plus one defense. Okay. Ink. 0.25 to skeletons level for a loop starting from the loop when this trait was received. Bang, that would have been nice in the beginning. Any direct damage to the hero will be evenly split between him and his skeletons. I guess we'll do laying down one's life. The skeletons are laying down their life for me now. Thank you, skeletons. Hopefully we'll get the boss to spawn like on the next one. There we go. We got a mountain. That's what I needed. We got more mountains. Oh, just what I needed. Oh, this should be fun right here. Okay, let's see what happens. I had the synergy and told me earlier and didn't even read it. I didn't see it. Don't cry. This is so sad. I should have... Well, maybe we'll get another level. Oh. But, but then I sacrifice all my attack speed. And I get a max skeleton back. Oh. Wah, wah. I think this one will be worth it. Thank God, an oblivion. We fucked up! First, you tell yourself you shouldn't backseat, and now you are sad you didn't read your backseat message. Well, I mean, I read the message. I didn't read the, uh, the, all the things. I think it's more so I didn't read it, all the available things. Hopefully we can uh, get the boss to spawn soon because we got to get the fuck out of here. Evasion. No, that's not worth it. Where do I even throw this stuff? Come on, boss. Spawn already. I'm fighting enemies everywhere. Storm temples are in everywhere, too. I'll throw down more ruins. We got some big badass skeletons with us, too. We're so close to having the boss spawn. Just give me a few more meadows. Yes, keep giving me meadows. Keep giving me meadows. Another mountain. Can't wait to be on its time zone. Everything is going to be filled. Ah, uh, yes. You can see right here, if we drop one more thing down, we should get to the fight. We should get the boss to spawn. If we drop one more thing. We found a bed. Okay, not yet. Maybe two more. The boss should spawn soon. The boss has spawned right on my camp. We just now have to get there through all of these enemies.
We just now have to get all the way back there. Here, we'll do a prediction. Will we beat the boss? Yes. No. You have two minutes to gamble. Will we beat the boss? This is a long one for the Let's Play channel. shield higher evasion by one lose a max skeleton gain some regen no thanks one gains four percent attack speed everything else stays the same evasion goes i want to replace that give me a touch more attack speed girl naruto thanks for the one year of subbing shout out to stina for that gifted sub yo shout out stina stina's fantastic thank you for the continued support it is very much appreciated i did see call to the lambs gonna release dlc but i didn't really get to look too much into it But I did see it on Twitter when I was at the gym, and I was like, oh, that's cool. A reason to play Call to the Lamb again. When you kill the goblin leader, they should stop spawning. <laughs> He's dead. The leader's dead. Oh, Lord. Hi, anime girl. Thank you again for the continued support. No! I didn't mean to get rid of that. I wanted to get rid of those spiders. God damn it. Oh, fuck. I wanted to get rid of the freaking spiders so they'd stop being archers. A very unfortunate misclick. Very unfortunate misclick. All right, we have three more battles we need to do. Then we got the boss. Ah, one of them escaped. Okay, one of them died at least. Skeleton level goes down. We lose attack speed. I don't think that's worth it. What's up, Laura? How are you doing? <gasps> oh, we get the big pimps. Thank God we get the pimp skeletons with us. Pips are here to stay. Could you please stop? I refuse. Tarms. Don't die on me, pimps. 
Don't die on me, pimps. I think all my pimps died. But luckily, they're spawning back quite a bit. Oh, God. My shield's down. Oh! I think we got it. What's up, GB? Hey! We got her. It hurts so much each time like the first. I still can't get used to it. Yeah, dying isn't very nice, and that's what the whole world feels right now. Not a great feeling, as you noticed. Now you! Wait, what do you mean each time? This is not the first time. My faith in the Almighty brings me back to life again and again for the sake of my great mission to spread his word and preach humility, obedience, and acceptance of the salvation he offers. And each time I fail, no peaceful conversation, only the lifeless bodies of the heretics or my lifeless body. And why can't you see the desire to survive as a natural part of this world? I didn't... I don't know how or when it happened, but you seem to have misunderstood the motives of the Almighty. Misunderstood? Me? That's impossible. I have faith. I am the faith. I don't need to know or prove anything. And you? What are you even trying to achieve? Nothing will ever be like it was anymore. Not even close. I don't know. Maybe it will. I can still try. You're just a fool! That's what you are. We'll meet again. Just let me rest for a while. Looks like she's gone. I can hardly believe her corpse could ever come back to life, but even if it will, I should still give her a proper burial. <sighs> pimp skeletons? Yeah, my pimps. Every loop I spawned three pimps with me. Will we beat the boss? Yes. Uh, choose one reward. 25% chance that an enemy will have one less ability in combat. No effect on bosses. The hero gets eight times loop XP each time a map tile is placed. Each time the hero kills an enemy, he will receive a stained glass window that has a 20% chance to absorb one hit and shatter. Stacks up three times. I'm gonna take the XP to be honest. That seems kind of good. Let's, uh, let's retreat. Let's leave. Welcome back. Is that a piece of glass sticking out of your shoulder? What? Oh, didn't even notice it. Not that my pain tolerance is too high. I'm a bit shocked, to tell the truth. I met a crazy zealot. Stained glass windows, halos, angel silhouettes all around the holy jamboree, you could say. Let me guess. We're all sinners and we're all doomed to face the holy wrath in the end of times and only in death shall we find salvation. More like the God has decided to erase his creation and is to be done. Please remain patient. Well, that makes some sense if you think about it. Who else has the power to do such a thing? I disagree. I don't know how much about being a God, but I think he'd be able to do it in an instant. Putting it simply, we'd all be dead already. We we wouldn't even exist now. Even if the priestess was right, it's not a reason to give up. Oh, howling from the outer space. What is this thing? What was that? Did you hear that? Yeah, and it felt horrible, like someone's coming to get me. Supplies. Oh, do, do these supplies act as buffs for the entire run now? If I put them in here. Oh, and they all go per chapter as well. That's cool. That'll be nice once I start getting better supplies. Ooh, we can build a mud hut. You can give residents furniture or food to store. A hovel made of sticks and mud. Houses only... One person, every resident, brings you closer to victory. Build more houses. <laughs> We're one step closer from the humble camp to a proud village, even though it's just a hut half buried in mud. But we are honestly grateful. The people who are very exhausted, body and mind, some private space to call home will make anyone happier. Of course, of course, I'm a good man. I'll make mud huts for my people. Hell, I'll make two mud huts for my people. <laughs> there we go. Now we can pack up the tents and the sleeping bags. I'll inform everyone in a few minutes. There's not enough houses for everyone, so several families we have to share. But still, now we're one step closer to civilized living. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't upgrade. Oh. 
Well, if you're watching on YouTube, make sure you like and subscribe. We made great progress because we actually finally beat chapter two.